guys, it's Nikki from Still Moments Nursery. Just going to do Scarlett's box packing for her trip home. Scarlet is a Aubrey by Denise Pratt doll kit. Uh, she's a nice sized baby at 20 inches. She's a custom order doll, so her mum requested that uh, she have thick light brown mohair. So it's nice and thick, so her mum can brush it and um, style it in many different ways. Little Scarlet's gonna go home dressed in this gorgeous little grow suit that I found for her. She's dressed in that ready to go home. She's also got a couple of other goodies uh, to go home with her, so I'm going to take you through those now. Uh, she's got a little outfit set that I picked out for her. So it's a little, just a little summer top with a little flower print on it. And it's got little spots on the back. And then to go with that, I found a little pair of leggings with some little love hearts on it. And I've also found these gorgeous little white cardigans or jumpers as well. So she's going to go home with one of those. And then I've got these knitted beanies as well. So I thought the colours are nice to match her grow suit. So I'm going to include that in her pack. And then she's also going to go home with a nice blue bib. I've put this one in photos so you can have a look how it matches her outfit in her photos. I'll put a link in the descriptions bar below. So she's going to go home with a blue bib. And that bib's to match the headband as well. So I'll just take that off her. So a blue headband. She's also got a couple of others that I'm going to include as well. So a nice lacy red one, and then just a plain light yellow or cream color as well. And then for her little feet, we've got a couple of, we've got a pair of socks, with some blue stripes, and then a little pair of booties, which I thought would suit her nicely with her outfit. So I'm gonna leave those attached to the packet um, put them into the box just as they are. But I'll wrap her socks up in her clothing pack. She's also going to go home with little mittens to keep her little hands warm. And they've just got little paw prints on them, which I thought was really cute. And she's got a couple of little teddies that I'm going to send home with her. So she's got the big, big teddy to cuddle and a little bunny rabbit, uh, which is a little key ring, so her mum can keep it as like a little mobile or hanging toy for her, or she can take it off and have it as a, a cuddle toy. And then for her dummy, mum requested that she have a magnetic dummy, so I've magnetised it and covered it with some nice soft fabric. And on it is a little ladybug. And then I'm going to pop that into a little calico bag that I found. And that's going to help protect it. And I found this nice little clear dummy as well. I'm going to include that as her pack. That's just a display dummy, so I've left the teat on. And I thought that was really cute in the little container. And of course, she's got her mohair conditioner and her baby powder. And I'm gonna put those into a Ziploc just so they don't leak. So they're gonna go into the box just like they are. She's also got her care instructions and her certificate. So I'm going to put those into a Ziploc to protect those as well. Okay. 
Okay, so just like that. And then also to go in the bag, I've got a little friendship bracelet that I'm going to include. Put in the back just like that. And then I found these cute little key rings as well. So that's just a little gift for her mum. And then giving her a little love heart charm that she can add to a bracelet or a necklace if she'd like. And then just a little ladybug, little sticker as well. And then I've got the little baby wafers uh, back in stock again. So you can buy these on the website if you're uh, after these. So I'm gonna include one. They just smell like baby powder just to make the room or your baby nursery smell nice and baby fresh. So just like that. Um, and that's for that Ziploc. And then I've got a little baby card that I'm gonna write a little message for her mum in there. So I'll do that just before I send her home. So that's a little card she's gonna go home with. And then for her clothing pack, which I'm gonna wrap up, I'm gonna do it in some nice Winnie the Pooh uh, themed paper. I'll just pop these out the way. And of course her little gold bow, which I'm gonna put on top. Okay, so her clothing, so she's got her and cardigan. Her top and her pants. Her beanie and her socks. Just like that. And then I'm gonna just wrap a bit of gold ribbon around there just to make it look a bit more pretty. Okay, so that's her clothing all wrapped and ready. Uh, she's gonna go home with a couple of different nappies as well. So I've got three designs there for her mum. So of course, Winnie the Pooh little animal, Australian animal possums as well. So they're gonna go in just like they are. And then to wrap up little Scarlet, I thought the little polka dot theme blanket would be nice and some nice red ribbon to go around it. So we'll wrap her up. She's all nice. Let's brush her hair. So she doesn't get travel hair. Okay. And then we're just gonna tuck her up. Just cross her legs, I've just found the way they fit in the box a little bit better. And we'll just wrap her up. face. Like 
Okay. And we'll just tie the ribbon around just to hold the blanket in place. Okay, so there's Scarlett all ready for her box. I've already lined her box with some nice white tissue paper. So I'll clear some room and we will be back to put her in her box and all of her goodies in her box as well. Back soon guys. Hey guys, it's Nikki from Still Moments Nursery. Are you wanting to bring a reborn doll into your home? I have many fully completed reborn dolls available. I also offer custom order reborn dolls in which you can keep the price of the doll within your budget by selecting exactly what you want your doll to have. There are also Remake Reborn dolls available of some of my most popular sold dolls. Thanks for watching and now it's back to the show. Okay guys, so we're back and we're gonna put little Scarlett in her box along with all of her other goodies and you guys can see how she's gonna be sent home. So we'll start off with baby Scarlett. As you can see, she fits nicely when her legs are nicely crossed. Uh, we'll start off with her nappies. And I like to put some just down by the feet to help protect her legs and her toes. And one just where her head is, just like that. And then I can slip some down either side of her face, just like that. And then I might put in her clothing pack, so I know that that's going to fit nicely. Just down there. Uh, her care instructions and her certificate. And I want those to stay nice and flat, so I'm going to slip them down the side. like that. Uh, then we've got her baby powder and her mohair conditioner. Now I'm going to slip that down. I might put that on the outside, just like that. In there. Uh, then we've got put in her booties. I'm going to put those upside down in a little corner. Maybe that corner up there. Okay, just like that. So nice. I might put one of her nappies just under there. Just sort of fill in little spots to make everything sit nice and flat. Just like that. And I might put in her little bunny toy. I want that just up at the top there so her mum can see the little toy. And we've got her little mittens. I'm just going to slip those there. Now her bib and her headbands. Her headbands I'm going to put into a little bag just so they don't get lost. like that and then I'll sit that on top as well makes it nice and colorful and then her little bib I'm gonna slip that down there and we've got her dummies so I'll put her little one down slip down the corner and I'm gonna put her dummy just there And then I've got to write in her little card, so I'm going to put that into the box last. But then that will sit. We put that on the top, just like that. And then I've got to try and get her little her teddy in, so 
I'll probably have to squish him. I'll lie him down there. And then her other nappies will sort of place on top just to hold everything in place. And then once I've wrapped over the tissue paper, I'm going to stick on her little gold bow on top. So that's how little Scarlett's going to be sent home and all the little goodies that she's going home with. I uh, hope you like the box packing guys and we will see you next time. Bye. Hey guys, it's Nikki from Still Moments Nursery. Just going to do, what you know? <laughs> Scarlet. Scarlet Rose. I'll just do the first name. Otherwise it'll be Scarlet Roses. That's not Rose. Yeah, yeah Scarlet. Scarlet. Hey guys, it's Nikki from Still Moments Nursery. Just going to do Scarlet's box packing for her trip home. Now sat nicely. <laughs> So guys, little Scarlet is a Aubrey by Denise Pratt doll kit. She is a custom order, so she isn't for sale. She is a nice sized doll. She's a 20 inch doll kit. So she's a nice cuddly baby, which is uh, really great um, to hold. So guys, Scarlet is a custom order doll. Uh, she is made from the Aubrey by Denise Pratt doll kit. Uh, she's a nice 20 inch size. She's a nice size. <laughs> I had all written down last night too.